Hello everyone and welcome to the part one of uh, direct shock control induction motor drive introduction. So in this video, we are going to talk about the basic uh, definition of DTC algorithm supply in induction motor drive, uh, the advantage, the feature, and finally we going to demonstration on a malaxima environment. So uh, let's get started first with uh, what is the DTC algorithm. So the DTC was developed more than a decade ago by WD and German researcher in the year of 80. And this drive with the DTC are being showed the great interest because of ABB has recently introduced a direct torque control in the induction motor drive. According to them, they can be worked at even at zero speed. So in uh, DTC drive, the flux liquid and electromagnetic torque are controlled directly and independently by the selection of uh, optimum inverter switching board. Uh, that means the selection is made to restrict the flux liquid and the electromagnetic torque arrow within the respective flux and torque heat transit band in, or in order to obtain the fast uh, torque response the low inverter switching frequency and finally we have the low harmonic uh, losses and here below we have the schematic of one simple form of DTC in that similar to right with the start of lock linkage thus it we are referred to as the start of lock DTC in a similar to right uh, however it should be noted that the other form also possible it means we have the rotor flux linkage or magnetic flux linkage DTC. And here we can see the inductive motor drive is supplied by the VDIs, which means the voltage shock inverter. And the start of flux linkage and electromagnetic torque arrows are restricted within their respective heat terrorist band. Uh, for this purpose, Two level of flux uh, heat transit converter and the three level of torque heat transit converter are used uh, respectively. Uh, and the output of flux and the torque converter are used in the inverter optimal switching table here. And we also use the information on the position of the start of flux linkage by vector. So, what is the main feature for DTC algorithm? So we have the direct torque, the DC, DTC provides a direct torque control of a start of flux and a special electromagnetic torque. We have the indirect control of start of current and voltage. And we have approximately the sinusoidal start of flux and start of current. And we can reduce torque oscillation. And we have the external torque dynamic. And finally, we have the inverter switching frequency depending on the flux and torque heat transit band. And um, what about the advantage of DTC compared with DTC? Uh, with uh, FOC, fuel rented, we in the DTC, we have the absence of a coordinate transformation, which also requires the most uh, vector control drive implementation. We have the absence of separate printed uh, modulation block requiring vector drive and we have the absence of voltage decoupling circuit compared with PMM motor drive we have decoupling between the ID and IQ which means a uh, response for torque and flux uh, controller respectively and finally we have the reduced number of controller for example only the speed controller you require if the drive contains a speed loop and the actual flux uh, leakage vector position does not have the, to be determined, but only the center where the factor, uh, the flux linkage is located. So, in the conclusion, in this video, we are going to talking about the main advantage, the main feature of uh, DTC algorithm. We look at the the basic, as uh, the basic scheme of uh, uh, DTC applied for induction motor. So in the next video, we are going to deploy it in MATLAB simulating environment uh, from a step by step. 
from the VRI's inventor, it doesn't machine. We can deploy, reboot the clock and talk comparator. So stay tuned, we and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.